versus Machamp uh, duel that's about to go on. A Wii U battle. Of course, we see the Nismegius. I don't see what Garchomp would gain at Nine Tails. That builds not that kind of thing. Okay. Field's a little even. It's still trying to call out some stuff from a champ. A champ counters through a premature Garchomp counter. Some very, very space neutral between them. Oh, now they're right up in their each other's faces. It looks like a release X, and I'm not sure how that didn't work, but it did not. Skyrise has caught it. He carries Eskido all the way to the wall. It goes back to the field. Safety frog set up to sort of reset the situation. Uh, it the kind of Eskido counter. Breaking that counter from guard. Uh, breaking my champ's counter. Miss Mage is set up. Let's go. But it's not gonna work because Skyrise is not against the wall, and Miss Mage is just done. Somehow, oh, okay, so Machamp does his command counter and uh, Garchomp salt sears through it because it's very short. Garchomp, punch it. Wide space control, and Tail will take the first. This guy still gets the bulk up, but we're still in good shape. Pretty evenly match right now. Sky is in box into dual phase. This Kadeo coming in from the sky into a Garchomp walk. Going to do his own burst. Uh, is that gonna catch? Does not. Whatever uh, Eskadale did, caught it. A Reskadale Corsillus does attack. Not a lot of time to use it, Leo. I left. Chooses not to because Sky is probably just gonna block it. Good smart stuff because. He didn't really gain anything breaking his shield anyway, besides off possible punishment. Countering through Skyrise and scoops. She commits all the way to. Counter corner pressure. Unfortunately, Skadale Wall trades the corner with Skyrise and is now the one under pressure. It was that uh, counter from a champ as Skyrise and cancels it. Interesting usage of its Magius here. Does give Garchomp the attack buff regardless, so it's pretty handy. Brave counter all the way through Machamp's punches, and he will take the first game. I'm not sure how Eskadale's doing it, Eskadale is doing it, but he's uh, not fearing any possible grab mix-ups from Machamp. And I don't know if it's just because Kyrazen hasn't done very many yet, or if he's thinking farther ahead than I am. But Skyrazen is, of course, doing a good job saving these grabs for what it really, really counts. I don't know if I've even seen a single submission yet, this uh, game, said. Release X combo. Does, uh, does some okay damage. Uh, for any other character, it'd be amazing. For Garchomp, it's pretty good. Granted that I don't envy anyone else to push these buttons. Alright, a little, some whiff action going on, but they're pretty safe. Oh, accidental release X from SK Dale will be punished by Skyrazen. Safety Frog keeping Shark in the corner. Sneak up submission. There's a grab. Of course, it's part of a combo. Owned by a dominant champ. So much pressure coming from Skyrazen. Uh, Skyrazen will take field, of course. Skadale finds himself in the corner, but how will he get out of this? He will 2x that counter and create a yucky yucky situation from a champ. His Magius does not fear that burst at all. In fact, she really does. It just goes through twice. Can't do much about my champ in the air while he's a burst, but that's okay. Because now he's out of burst. But that's punishable. That's the, dr the screw that's punishable. Eskadale fearing nothing whatsoever, knowing 2x is a great option. Saving his grab for when it counts. Bear in mind, of course, this is Skyrim's set right here. He's on a uh, set point, although... If, if Eskadale can take a round, he'll be on match point. No, he won't. This one is semis? Anyway, we'll keep going. Gets out of the corner, punishes his mission, whiffing. 
into a guard jump combo. I don't think he could possibly do enough in one combo to kill him, so he will reset those facial points. Into another combo. That this should be enough, right? There we go. Brown going to SK Dale. Taking some tasty synergy, which is unique because he burned it all up just now. They got it all back. I don't know what cheer he's running. Brave counter, not taking frogs mix ups. Your frog setups. Alright, you see what's cute about Release X is that totally beats Machamp's counter if you time it correctly. Sand Tornadoes are putting pressure on Skyrism, but it's not enough. Skyrism will get out of that situation into duel. Cornering Garchomp. Oh, okay, that's good, Dale. I don't know if he's predicted that's for. He's preparing for that submission, but he gets out of it anyway. Miss Meiji is gonna be a baller and save him from. I'm not familiar with how to get around it myself. I just feel like I got a shield and respect it so it goes away. But he does land that burst. We can do some serious damage to our poor unbursted chomp. Mix up. What's he gonna do? This is problematic for Escadale, but he gets out of it. And into burst, and now I feel like the tables have turned. skyrison has gotta survive this burst attack if he wants to take this set, but he's not going to. Escadale will take this round and... Uh, it looks like the set because he got up and started freaking out like how close this was. I think he thought he was gonna die. <laughs> but they're laughing about it, so... Very good play to both of them. Good way to keep their cool under pressure. And I will probably let somebody on commentary 